lot of interest in these windows that I put in the camper. They're made by Turn Overland and they're sandwich type deal. I used the inner trim ring as a template, uh, lined it up with some little pilot holes that I had drilled through the wall of the camper. I'd framed some wood, uh, kind of pre-planned where the windows were gonna be, so I'd have some wood backing. And uh, so really all I had to do was cut through the foam and uh, flax epoxy composite. Uh, wasn't cutting through any wood. So it's just, just the, the foam sandwich construction which uh, is just shy. It's about an inch and seven eighths thick. Um, and um, yeah, it's good to have some pre-planned openings there. The windows have a, a rubber gasket on the inside of the uh, outer trim ring the window, so there's no need for any caulking. And then uh, you put the, the inner trim ring from the inside into the hole and uh, then there's screws uh, that, that go through the inner trim ring into the outer trim ring on the window and uh, squish it together. I'm supposed to use a screwdriver but I, I went ahead and cheated. Yeah, it's really clean installation. I was super pleased. The nice thing is they have a, uh, a screen um, blind hidden cassette deal that you put on the inside some little French cleats that hang on it and then it's secured with screws and there's a foam rubber um, gasket on the inside of that so that there's no drafts or leaks and it makes it nice no bugs you can you can open the window and then uh, it's got a couple different settings, uh, three different actual, it's kind of like low, medium, and high opening, and then you can independently use the, the blind or uh, the screen, keep bugs out, or sun out, or both, and uh, well, yeah, you can't kind of, I, I, I'm choosing to put the blind from the bottom, on uh, the bottom side, you can flip it either way, but mm, the bottom line is, is that uh, they're dual pane acrylic insulated keep the sun out bugs out be able to see outside um, versatile rad units <laughs>